Welcome back, Jawa fans. Oh. Oh yeah, that's nice. For all seven of you that follow me, I'm sure you're gonna appreciate that. It's a lot better than the rock and roll one. Anyway, on that subject, we will be doing an intro here pretty quick, probably, hopefully this weekend. Uh, we did get a bunch of snow up here in the Rocky Mountains and we're gonna go snowmobiling and skiing and doing all that stuff. So uh, we'll see, but we'll be getting an intro here to you pretty quick uh, before we get started don't forget to like the videos and subscribe and all this stuff and I'll repeat it again will be listed on the video down below in the description page first of all let's go fast because I know that my audience has a very very low attention span like me most of you are related to me so that's why I know that Mavic Air, bom, bom. Mavic Air, pretty cool. You already know I shoot with that. You saw some of the footage, you see how it's controlled, and we'll take video of me videoing with the Mavic Air and my other camera. Uh, hopefully soon. My other camera happens to be an EOS M50. A lot of people love it on YouTube, a lot of people don't. Great for video. Uh, not so great for photos, what they say, but this guy is not so great with photo either so we're gonna find out if we can maximize its capabilities then we'll change it otherwise for right now that's the best camera in the world to go with it I have a somewhere around here one of these bad boys it's a Rokinon 14 millimeter 2.8 all those numbers it's pretty cool and that's for night photography and long exposure it's a wide angle lens so hopefully uh, what I'm going to start out with is taking some nighttime stars and Milky Ways and hopefully that'll be soon once the weather clears up. I think the winter time is probably the best time to do it. The air is cold, clean, crisp, and clear. Next thing is we got some UV filters for the um, lenses we have. I don't know that they're the best. They do mount differently. They're not screw on. They're just squares that you kind of hang up in front. I saw him, I saw Kai use them. He's uh, another YouTuber, YouTuber with a bunch of followers. I shouldn't say another one because I don't have any followers, but that's okay. Um, but he's a YouTuber. He uses the square ones he mounts on the front and whatever it works for him. So it must work for me. Uh, I have a 22 millimeter Canon lens. The lens is for shooting things. I don't know yet, but we're gonna find out. We're gonna learn as we go. Somebody said on a YouTube video I needed to get a 22 millimeter lens, so I went and bought it. I got a lens adapter. Uh, apparently this M50 doesn't use, or doesn't have a lot of lenses available to it. So you need to buy a lens adapter so that we can then use some other lenses. So I do have that. I have uh, a handle that, that I thought a GoPro was attached to. It's a little tripod style handle. I can set it places and then hold it while I'm skiing. It feels a little weak in the hand, but you know what? It's actually pretty cool. I like it. We used it this last weekend for skiing. We have a GoPro 7 Black. Uh, it's pretty cool. Love it. Does time lapse and it actually shoots pretty well. Has some manual mode settings. Um, I've played around with a little bit and adjusted some of them and I think I'm gonna get better uh, In fact, I know I'm going to get better. I think I'm already getting better. We're, we're gonna see um, Let's see what else what else what else we have a memory storage Nobody likes digging around in the back of their bag for memory cards So I have a little hard case storage for that. So at least they're all centralized um, you already know about the Mavic, you know about my old stuff, that nobody cares. And let's just talk about the camera bag. I know it's a camera bag, uh, because it reads it's a camera bag. I don't know if you can see that. Zoom in on it. Come on, M50, your legendary zoom. Um, and it's made in China, so you absolutely know it's the best. Right? Anyway. We also have, it's actually a pretty cool bag. I like it a lot. 
It's got lots of little storage places, little storage places. I said that twice just for the dramatic effect apparently. It also has all the cool places for the lenses and camera and space and whatever. And you can adjust all those. I've never had a camera bag so it's kind of cool. Whatever. And then down here in this bottom section uh, we have room for the ba -ba -da, Mavic Air and it's self-contained bags to fit into and then in the back like most backpacks there's a slot for an iPad or a computer not a real big one though it's gonna have to be a small computer so that's pretty much my oh yeah it does come I gotta tell you that it comes with a poncho in case it's raining which in for an M50 it's not water resistant it's not weatherproof uh, that M50 you don't want to take out in the rain. So I did make sure I had a poncho for the backpack just to make sure that none of those stuff gets wet. So with that said, again, thank you again for watching. Thanks for coming, hanging out with us. And please like and follow us. That's all we ask. It's just simple. It really is. Help us out. So take care. Have a great day. Thanks for coming. Bye.